the circulator day, a plus O equals anarchy is order, the circle day, based on Jason Whaling's 1995 essay Anarchism and the history of the black flag, a plus O equals anarchy is order. The inner circle is already widespread and is so well known and recognized that it has ended up being considered a traditional symbol, giving the impression of being old time. Thus, for example, the American magazine Fight the State, 1997, thinks it sees an A in a circle on the helmet of an anarchist militiaman in the Spanish Revolution. Some even claim to go back to Proudhon. In reality, the A is little more than an upstart in libertarian iconography. The A in a circle was born in 1964 in Paris and in 1966 in Milan. Two dates and two places of birth? Yes, and we'll see how. Indeed, it is in April 1964 when the internal bulletin of the Junus's Libertries, that is, of the young French anarchists, four cats, at that time, the young anarchists in France, as in Italy, appears the proposal of a graphic sign for the whole anarchist movement, beyond different tendencies, groups and federations. Why this proposal? We have been driven by two main reasons, above all to facilitate and make more effective graffiti and posters and, furthermore, to ensure a greater presence of the anarchist movement in the eyes of the people and a common character to all expressions of anarchism in its public manifestations. More specifically, it was a question, for us, of finding a practical means that would allow, on the one hand, to reduce to a minimum the time taken to sign our slogans on the walls and, on the other, to choose a sufficiently general sign to be adopted by all the anarchists. The acronym proposed by us seems to meet these criteria. By constantly associating it with anarchist verbal expressions, he will end up, by a well-known mental automatism, evoking in people, by themselves, the idea of anarchism. The proposed graphic sign is a capital A inscribed in a circle. Why? Perhaps due to the derivation of the already widespread anti-militarist symbol, in which the chicken foot is replaced by the initial letter of the word anarchy in all European languages. Perhaps by other suggestions. For example, the secretary of the Alliance Ouvrier Anarchist, a tiny French-speaking anarchist federation, Raymond Blitton, wrote to me in 1984 that, from 1956-57, the first members of the O used in their correspondence, after signature, an acronym that was first an A inscribed in a circle, in turn inscribed in another A, to effectively give O, later converted into a double A inscribed in an O. The truth is that the first public use of the A in a circle by such alliance appears in June 1968 in its cyclostyled bulletin Linarchy. But, let's go back to 1964. The Junus's Libertor's proposal does not bear, at the moment, any fruit. In December of the same year the A in a Circle reappears in the title of an article signed by Thomas Ibanez, in the Action Direct newspaper, edited by the same group of young anarchists who, in the aforementioned bulletin eight months earlier, had proposed that identity sign. But, again, no replica in the French anarchist movement, far from it, international. It is necessary to wait until the beginning of 1966 for the symbol of the circulator day, proposed by the Genueses Libertors, to be taken up and used, initially experimental, then regularly, by the Gioventu Libertaria de Milan, a group of young people anarchists, who had fraternal relations with young Parisians, with whom he had formed a short-lived but bombastic federation international des Junuses Libertors. It is since then when the sign begins its public life. First in Milan, where it became a common signature on the pamphlets and posters of young anarchists, and then returned to France and spread fairly quickly throughout the world. Marianne Inkle says there is no proof of the use of the A circulated in the Parisian May and she found little evidence of its presence outside of Italy until 1972-73. It is at the beginning of the 70s, when the circulated day explodes with a spontaneous mimetic appropriation by anarchists all over the world, a resounding success that has made some say that, if its inventor had patented the circulator day, it would be today billionaire. What are the causes of rapid and intense fortune? More or less expressed by the JJSS.
That is, on the one hand, the simplicity that makes the circle day one of the most immediate symbols, such as the hammer and sickle, the swastika. On the other hand, a new movement, young, expanding, which sought a unifying sign. Thus, in the absence of an anarchist graphic symbol, the A in a circle actually prevailed. This is the true story of the circulator day, which is made of both conscious will and spontaneity. A typically libertarian cocktail.